part two. Now, children, moving to the next page. Who is this? Who is this? Is she big or small? Is she big or small? Who does pig come with? Who does pig come with? How does giant pig come? How does giant pig come? Come. So, children, this question means what mode of transport has giant pig used to come to the party? Okay, now the next page. How did the dogs come? How did the dogs come? How many dogs can you see? How many dogs can you see? And can you count them? Can you count them? Now, next page. Who is this? Now, who is this? Okay. How does the duck travel? How does the duck travel? What sound does the motorboat make? What sound does the motorboat make? What do you see in this picture? What do you see in this picture? Children, you have to tell me everything that you can see in this picture, okay? Next question. Does the bus come in fast or slow? Does the bus come in fast or slow? Now, moving to the next page. Now, children, look at this picture. What do you see here? What do you see here? Have you ever seen a bullock cart? How many of you have seen a bullock cart and where have you seen the bullock cart? Okay. What color are the crows? What color are the crows? Can you show its beak? Children, what I want you to do over here is the person who is assisting you, I want you to show that person the beak of the crow. Okay, next question. What do crows do with their beaks? What do crows do with their beaks? So children, beak is a very important part for the bird. It is the mouth of the bird. So the birds use the beak to pick up food and eat it. The birds use the beak to break something that is hard, tear something, okay, to carry some things in their mouth. When mama bird goes to collect food, so she takes the food in her beak and she gives it, gets it home for the baby bird. Okay, children? Now, children, turn to the next page. Look at this picture carefully. What animals are sitting on the horse? What animals are sitting on the horse? Whose back did hens and chickens ride on? Whose back did hens and chickens ride on? Have any one of you sat on a horseback? Children, have you ever had a horseback ride? Have you ever sat on, the, on a horseback? So, please answer. Now, moving to the next page. Children, I want you to look at this page very carefully. Okay? And I want you to tell the names of the different modes of transport that you can see on this page. I want you to look at the picture and name the different modes of transport. Now, coming to the last page of the story. Name all the animals that you see in this picture. Name all the animals that you see in this picture. So children, with this, we come to the end of the activity. I hope you were able to answer all the questions. And also, I hope you have enjoyed reading and doing all the activities with story number 13. So children, till we meet again, I want you to keep reading one storybook every day. Okay, so take care children. Bye.